Good evening, everyone. So, we're back at it again. So, you guys have seen that I've been uh, doing the sulfuric acid stripping cell. Well, this guy here, we ran, you know, about a pound and a half through, and then we uh, let it settle for about a week. Then we ran about a pound and a half to two pounds through, and we let it settle for another week. So now, what I'm about to do is I'm going to pour the acid back in this bottle here for storage, and then we're going to clean out the dish. My glasses keep falling up on me here. So now I'm getting ready to start. I've already wiped out my... Uh, funnel. I've got everything down here prepared during this next process I'm going to be concentrating so I probably won't be talking a lot. Okay, I want to clean the top of this real quick. And you don't want to hit this with a wet now, what this has on it is, uh, it's a little damp from the rinse water that I've already been using, so it's already got a little bit of sulfuric in it already. So, I got her clean, I'm going to set that aside, so you guys know if you're ever messing with sulfuric acid, you cannot wipe off with water. So behind me I've got baking soda here and I've got paper towels ready to go. If anything happens I'll wipe it with paper towel. I'll wipe it with another and then I'll hit it with the baking soda and then we'll hit it with water. It's still a little dark here, so there's still a little bit of gold in it. Ah, I'm, I'm getting bit by a fly. Or You're a not the only one. <laughs> yeah, Joe's on the camera again. Hi guys, how you doing? So, I don't know if you can see from there. All my slime is going into the corner. Right. And now we've gotten to the point <clears throat> where it's, uh, I, I don't want to pour my gold off. So at this point, we're going to pour into our, wa our rinse water bucket. If I have to clean it again, I clean it again. Now you got your looks... spatula? Mm-hmm. Now, I don't know if you were able to pick that up. As I was pouring this in, this splashed out. Guys, this ain't no joke. Don't ever take it lightly, okay? I had a spatula ready in case I had to do a little scraping. But thankfully, it seems to all be coming out here. <clears throat> you know, I've done a few different processes in gold refining. This is the first time I've done the uh, cell. And, uh, you know, I'll be honest with you guys. I want to be around for a long time, so I try and take every precaution I can. 
I don't want to hurt myself or do anything that could hurt Joe or my grandbabies. So, does it look like I'm really nervous at times? Yes, and that's because I am. But, at the same time, you can't be so scared that you lose all your confidence either. If you're going to do this, once you start, you're committed. Okay. So, I think I'm all sprayed off here. So, first thing I got is a dirty towel I've already been using. paper towels here and I found a spot in the back already if you didn't know sulfuric acid <clears throat> against a filter or a paper towel will just burn it. it it'll turn it to ash so you have to use something you can't filter it period don't even try it um, Get this done. Okay, set it back here. Getting the wet one we've already used to wipe the top back off again. I know some of you guys that have been doing this for a while might be laughing. I can imagine I'm probably funny looking doing this. But you funny looking anyway, babies. Woohoo! <laughs> um, <clears throat> as I said, I just want to be safe about it. So, uh, the next video you'll see about this thing is when we go after this. But uh, I think we're gonna stop for the night because the rest of it's gonna be boring. All I'm gonna do now is get my station cleaned up. I'm gonna put a lid on this, not tight, but put a lid on it. And then I'm gonna set it back here to settle. You're supposed to let it settle for a minimum of two days. It's going to settle for me for one week. I'll be back next week to show you the rest. Mike's out of here. Take care.